Hey YouTube, I'm going to show you how to uh, how to on install iTunes, the newer version, and downgrade it in the iTunes. So, um, I got a iTunes 10 to um, 10 uh, iTunes 10.2.1. And I tried to try to downgrade to 9.0 iTunes cuz I want to downgrade to 3.1.3. So yeah, uh, and then then I will get a job broken of it. So so first of all, you just go to allapps.com, and over here it must be this category, and you can see the iTunes 9.0. It said this latest month. So to so to down to down the older version first, you need to um, start control panel. Um. So, so if you put small icons or large icons, all you have to do is just put categories and uninstall programs. Cause, yeah. Well, let's see. No, not that. Pro I mean, uninstall programs. Oh, man, not. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. There it is. So you all, all you see over here, right? So once or once you found iTunes is this program, you you have to do is just click here. And uninstall but that was an example not not like not the real thing like this okay but if you found iTunes like for example oh, look I found an iTunes 10 so what am I supposed to do oh okay just uninstall it so yeah don't don't uninstall it with this I'm just showing you an example just don't so so now you press X if you finish uninstall because I already installed it I'm mean, uninstalled so first of all that once once you went to all apps, you can choose any version you want. 10.0, um, 9.0, 8.0. I mean, yeah, now there's 10. Point, now there's iTunes 10 all the way below to the iTunes 4. So once you once you choose 9.0.1, which which I don't, which I'm going to choose it, you click here. You click here again to install it. And once you finish to install it, you click run. See, it's verifying. Okay, so it's Papa said to install iTunes, you need to you you must agree to do this. It happens to you know it happens to Apple.com like you try you're going to install iTunes and now now you're trying to accept it. So yeah, happens to this. So look at this. This is the old iTunes logo, and this one this um. This installer guys you through the steps or blah blah blah. That's for the um next to the column of QuickTime. So you click next. You click I accept it. Click next. Uh let's see, add iTunes to QuickTime shortcuts to my desktop. Yes, yes, and yes. Okay, so yeah. And you can see that this is the iPod Touch third generation. Uh, iPod Classic, which is still, uh, which is still, um, already came out the new iPod Classic, and the old, um, iPod Nano, which is fourth or fifth generations, and iPod Shuffle, uh, which one, uh, was it like four, you know, no, I think it's, no, wait, no, that's the iPod Shuffle, uh, 3G. Yeah, um. Yeah, that's why I always, always like that. Just like in Apple.com to to install. So once you, so once you finish to to load of iTunes, you just click next. Bro, not yet. I just just want to downgrade to 9.0.1. Cause I want to downgrade my iPod Touch and then jailbroken. Yeah, that's what I like. My brother has 4.2.1 iPod Touch, but he wants to downgrade to 3.1.3. But I told him that, hey, you need to you you need to SH SH. But I I can do I can do without SH SH blobs because once it said SH SH on City, I said 4.2.1, 4.1, 4.0. But once I ha once I have my iPod Touch 4.3.1 and Joe Walker already, I. It said SHSH 4.2.1, 4.3, but I downgraded 4.3b2. And once I downgraded without SHSH to 4.2.1, he 
guess what? It already downgraded, and I felt really happy, cause it's cause it depends on SHSH file on the Cydia. It's a 4.2.1, so I, once I follow direction 4.2.1 without um, SHSH blobs, uh, tiny umbrella, it 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 um, down firmware in my iPod Touch 4G. Yep, now it already installed and then uh, Joe Rogan Green Poison. And now I felt really happy. I tried to downgrade 4.1, but it won't it won't do it no more because you know my SHSH file still still on 4.2.1 on all 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 the above not below because now it doesn't say 4.1 no more. Uh, it sucks. So yeah, but I try to use my strings on 4.2. One, but now I already downgrade this 4.1 and my strings say suck this <laughs> I do so I suck this it wants you hold this and it said don't think about it I was like okay I won't think about it so the coolest thing is this move to un move to unlock see this is awesome I'm trying to do my 4G but it doesn't work I mean I mean, it said all devices works, but mine's is new ones and frozen, and yeah. So that's 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 why I want to downgrade iTunes, iTunes Nine because I want to downgrade firmware, and yeah, that's what that's all I wanted. And jailbroken. So I need to wait for this, please. If you guys don't want to wait, just skip the. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> so, okay, so open iTunes after you install Access. So, once you click finish and you click close, uh, what the uh, X? Wait until um, it shows up. Oh, see? Felt really happy. Agree. If it doesn't work, I will show you. See? It said over here, um, the file iTunes library that ITL cannot be read because it was created by a newer version of iTunes. So listen, guys, if you if you're tired of this, you just go to search. You go to search again over here. If you have Windows Seven or Windows Vista, Windows XP, I'm not sure, but I I, I hope there's a search button. So you click I iTunes library that ITL okay so once once I type it set iTunes library nope I mean iTunes let's see you see there is program oh wait no there's two it's a program and music so all you have to do is don't delete programs of this. You you must delete this a music file like this. So you click here. You click delete. You click yes to recycle. And yep, and then you're done. And you click here to the old iTunes. See what happens. Oh, if one of your computers don't show up like this, just delete the program file. But if it doesn't show anything, well, you need to find anything that that has um, iTunes library. And you see, over here, it said iTunes. The, oh, wait, no, no. That was requires my brother's iTunes library. Um, so you click OK. But that, that was for Jared's iPod. But, yeah, see, there you go. This is the iTunes 9. Point zero point one, and you see it works everything. You can downgrade to four point one to three point 